Today I'm working on an 87 Ford E250. It's got a uh, 302 in it. Um, replacing the heater core. I already put it in. I figure I go over the, the basics here. It's pretty simple. Come over here in the uh, passenger side. <clears throat> so with this 87, you have to uh, unscrew this. You have to take the side panel off. And then um, when you take this down, you'll get, uh, you'll get in this compartment over here. This box. There's one, two, three, and then a couple more. There's a total of five bolts that you need to undo. And what is that is um, all undone. You can uh, take that thing out. And you come over here under the hood. And you, that's when you'd be able to remove this thing. Take it all out. Only... Uh, only wire you'll have to undo is this guy right here. Obviously, you can take out the battery. Once this is taken out, you can access your heater core. It's uh, screwed down. Unscrew the, the thing that's holding it in place. And then you can put your new heater core in and then just put it back together. Um, and once that is, I'm over here working on my water pump, replacing that. So everything's all gutted right now but um if you're only replacing your heater core it's pretty damn simple it took me maybe about 30 minutes um and then it's just two two lines um it's one from the uh the water pump and one the other line is back here behind the water pump but um yeah that's pretty much it for your your 87 E250 heater core replacement. There you go.